Alright, what's going on? This is my video about testosterone, the big T. Uh, I think this is a week six video. I'm, I think. There's a few questions here I need to an answer for you. Do you plan on taking testosterone? Yes, yes I do. I'm already on T. Uh, if you are on testosterone, how long have you been on it? Well, I was on a extremely low dose for over a year, which uh, I was not very happy about, but recently have increased my dose so but anyway it's been 15 months since I've started tea uh, how do you get testosterone I'm gonna tell you the legal way to do it um, I had to see a therapist or a psychologist or whatever that specialize in gender um, dysphoria and um, general GLBT um, counseling. She, after a while of seeing her, discussing my, you know, going into detail about my life and my intent to transition and why and to prove to her I wasn't insane and whatever else you got to do, she approved me for her hormone therapy and referred me to a doctor that then started me on tea. They wrote me a prescription, I took it to Walgreens and got it filled, and that's how I got the tea. What forms does testosterone come in? I think the most popular ones are the injectable suspension um, of what you have to, you know, uh, give shots with gel and cream. Now, there are other forms. I'm not sure if they still use them or, but I know there was one that you used to put like sub Q so like up under your skin that would release it over time I don't know if they even use that anymore I don't know what it was called and also they used to have a tea pill but it was too hard on the liver so I'm not sure that they still give that anymore that's all the forms I know about there could be others out there but um how long do you have to take it I'm under the assumption you have to take it for the rest of your life I mean I I'm planning on having to take it for the rest of my life. Um, what are the effects of testosterone? Um, it masculinizes you. I mean, to watch um, you know, to watch a boy go through puberty, a lot of what's happening with them will happen with you. You know, your voice will drop. It'll crack for a while, then it'll drop. Um, it'll cause body hair, facial hair. Um, change in body shape sometimes, redistribution of body fat to a more male pattern. Um, let's see. Uh, growth in the genital area. Um, libido, a in, big increase in libido for some people. Um, let's see, what else? It, it can sometimes, like I've heard, it can affect um, your temper, but I do want to clarify if you didn't have a problem with anger before tea, you're not going to become a raving lunatic after you start taking tea. That's a big myth that I really like to dispel at every chance I get. Um, but it, I think it can kind of change how you handle um, anger or how you express it or, or feel it. So, but that's not to say you're even mean or anything like that, it's just kind of different, you know. Um, uh, what else? Effects of testosterone. It can change your um, red blood cells, <clears throat> you know, your, your, um, you can end up with more red blood cells in your body, lower good cholesterol, higher bad cholesterol, um, sometimes higher blood pressure. That's not always the case. I mean, everybody's body responds differently. Um, other effects. I think that's it, really. Your face, a lot of times your facial shape and, and everything will change a lot too. What are the side effects of stopping testosterone? Some of your changes will reverse back to a more female, um, you know, like you, maybe close to how you were before T, but that really depends on how long I think that you've taken tea. If you've been on tea for like 10 years and you have to stop or want to stop, 
a lot of things just are not really going to change. I think um, body hair would be less thicker. Your voice is going to stay the same. Once the vocal cords thicken, they're, they're, they're like that. Um, facial hair will, will still be there. Um, you may, may or may not resume the monthly cycle ordeal um, and your body fat will probably change back um, face once your face has changed I'm not sure how much that would change back but um, you know you might notice a change in libido I think the growth in the genitals is permanent probably um, plus you know mentally it can be very difficult for some guys to have to stop tea because sometimes it's not a question of do you want to but that you have to because of health problems so um, anyway I think that's about all I got for this video and thank you for watching uh, I'll see you soon